Adele, Kate, and JD Phoenix. I wonder what J stands for. Oh, oh my, my gosh! <laughs> <laughs> Why did she die? Oh my gosh. <laughs> she should have stayed outside. <laughs> oh my gosh, yeah, she should have listened to her uncle. My Jeez, goodness. How could a, you have prevented that? What a, I don't know, what a violent <laughs> end. I bet that's a freak accident. That's not actually supposed to happen. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to It's Obvious Gaming, and welcome to Gears of War 4. My name's Garrett Drake, I'm joined alongside my best friend, Jacob Alka. How you feeling, Jacob? I'm feeling great, how are you this afternoon? I'm great, I'm about half an hour into Gears 4. Ooh. Enjoying it so far, clearly I'm rocking the t-shirt today in nice. honor of the release. I'm uh, supporting the Atlanta Falcons, who are three and one. Great. <laughs> and what do there. Falcons do? They rise up. They do rise up. Hey, if you are a fan of the Falcons in the comments, I'll buy you Gears of War 4. Wow. No, I'm not going to do that. Okay, I was going to say, that's pretty bold. I bet a hundred people are going to say they're Falcons <laughs> Like, fans. oh yeah, sure, I'm a Falcons fan. I play for the Falcons. That's great. Well, Jacob, I'm, like I said, I'm about half an hour into the game, enjoying it so far. It's interesting. And uh, I'm currently playing as JD Phoenix, as we know, the son of Marcus Phoenix. With my friends, I know Kat, I think is the girl's name, if I'm not mistaken. I can't remember the rest of their names. I just started, bear with me. But we've been invading this, or raiding, I should say, this coalition settlement that's being built by these security robots. Been fighting our way through it. I'm not exactly sure why we're raiding it, but I'm pretty sure we're about to find out, so let's move forward and see. Let's go. Yeah, very pretty game, as you can see. It looks a lot better than the beta looked, clearly. Mm -hmm. So you're the son of Marcus Phoenix, Oh, correct? here they are, yes. I am the son of Marcus Phoenix. JD Phoenix, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna just go ahead and guess that the D in his name stands for Dominic, and Dominic Santiago. Dominic Toretto. Close! From Fess. All the fast. It's actually <laughs> Vin Diesel. It's D for Diesel. Oh. So that Dominic, yes, correct. No, but Dominic Santiago was Marcus's best friend in Gears 1 through 3. Okay. And uh, he will be solely missed, God rest his soul. I think I remember when he passed. Yes. He as well. I think I played the only game that he passed in. <laughs> yeah, one of the more heartbreaking moments in my video game career, for sure. It hit mm -hmm. me in the chest. But um, we remember him fondly, and uh, we're, we're fighting again in Gears, so... I really do like this rifle I'm using too. I also can't what's the name of it. The Marska? Markza MK1. Markska. I like the shotgun force too. It's a little submachine gun. I've never actually used well they've had, they've had sort of submachine gun-ish guns in the past in gears, but I like this one a lot. Why don't you use your shotgun? Time. That's what's important in gears, right? right? Yeah, shotguns uh, run rampant as we know. I actually dropped it to use this gun since it's new. Yeah, it looks cool. Yeah, it is very cool. Let me see if I can pull off a cool execution for you in a second. I can probably get this guy if he goes back into cover. Oh, crap. Hold on. Nope, not this time. Well, we got him nonetheless. Maybe next time. <laughs> oh, look at that. Cog deactivated our access codes. Well, we <laughs> this guy with <laughs> the beard. Yeah. <laughs> Looks awesome. Cog didn't teach you how to That's her uncle. Lock. Okay. Get out of the way. Excuse me. <laughs> Uh, that's one way to do it. Look, that's state of the art cog technology. I don't think. Oh, okay. You two go get that fabricator. Okay, the fabricator, that's what we're here for. I'm going to. Oh no, you're not. It's safer out here. Doors closing, young ones. Okay. Nope. Oh. Sorry, old man. It's the kids' turn. <laughs> Teenagers with attitude. I don't know what a fabricator does or is. So we're about to find out together. I'm kind of excited. Yeah, I'm not going to act like I know. I've heard of the word before. Me too. And in Gears of War, I don't recall ever hearing that that word. So It helps something else work. I know that. Okay. It's a part of something. Kate, not Cat, excuse me. Del is uh, the other guy. Is it, is it spelled K-A-T? K-A-I-T. Okay, well, yeah, that's Kate. Yeah. We're aboard. The subtitles have clarified that for me. Hey. I've always appreciated uh, subtitles. Yeah, I play with them in certain games, but not all games. Like, I always like having them on just to glance down, mm -hmm. just to make sure I can hear everything. But I prefer just to look at their mouths. Me too. I uh, turned them on in Deus Ex because none of the voices synced up to the mouths and it was very distracting. So I just read that game. <laughs> I've been couldn't, very... tell you, couldn't tell you half of what the cutscenes look like. I've been very vocal about how 
much I don't like Adam Jensen, his voice and all that. So Yeah, well, also, in his defense, you haven't played all the way through one of his yeah, games. I yet. haven't played any of them. He so. grows on you, I promise. <laughs> is that the two factions you play in multiplayer, is the Cogs and the... Cogs? Well, in this one, I know for a fact there's Cogs, DBs, the Swarm. I don't know if you can play as Locust in this one or not. It'd be cool if you can. You'll have to wait and see. I cut the power to sneak back in. Do you control this lift or not? Yes! And we're deep. Cause I'm in too deep. <laughs> Great song. I love that song. What happened to the other guy? Uh, he's up there controlling the lift we're on. All right, That'd be watch terrifying. yourself, Kate. Stay close to me this time. Look me in the eyes. Don't move. It's going to be just fine. We're totally going in there. I can feel it. Nope, nope. Careful. I think he... Okay, we're good. We're good. <laughs> Ooh, that was too close. Remind me to let you handle the controls next time, okay? I heard that. The DBs. Eyes up, there's the fabricator. Eyes up, there's the fabricator. Okay. Is this it? Fabricator. Hey. Oh, okay. that's that simple. Alright. The DBs sound like D V from uh Tim and Eric uh Krimbus special. Yeah, it's a great short, right, great special. Yeah. If you guys haven't seen Tim and Eric's Crimbus special, you should watch it this holiday season around Christmas time. Yeah. It's, it's before Christmas, but I yeah. think it's like in the teens. I can never remember the exact right. date. Yeah, somewhere in there. In December, Crimbus special. Tune in. And if you never heard of Tim and Eric, also give that a shot on YouTube. Just type in Tim and Eric and click on a video that pops up. Yeah, you're certainly in for a treat if you haven't uh, experienced it before. Build it's it's a... Oh, this is how you build weapons. That's why we need it, because when we're rebuilding, we need to defend ourselves. Gotcha. Okay, let's build a Nasher shotgun. I'm in the mood. Wait, nice. I have 5,000 available? Okay. This is totally going to play a role in uh, horde mode, too. I can feel it. Fabricator path. Fire. Recharge over time. Check back. Okay, it'll recharge eventually. I don't think it's good to go right now. I think we're good for now. They're DBs. Yep, here they are. Can't remember. I think these are called shockers, I think. Tracers, that they're called. Kick them. Oh, that's awesome. Like a soccer ball. Oh, nice. <laughs> that's great. Okay, I'm going to destroy this guy. This is what I was trying to do. Oh. Gotcha. Nice. See, that stuff's cool. I like that's a new... Oh, my gosh. <laughs> that's a new feature. You can vault over and kick them and then execute them instantly, which is cool. You can also pull guys over cover. Let me see if I can do that. No, he's too far away. Mm. Headshot. I'll never forget Cliffy B when he first announced Gears 2. He came out on stage after the debut trailer that showed off chainsaw duels, and everyone was freaking out. And he chainsawed through a screen and came through it. He's like, yes, Gears 2 is officially coming. He's like, and you're going to be a. He's, gonna, he's like, you're going to want to be a, bring a bucket this time. There's to be a lot more blood. And then he walked off the stage. What he chainsaw through something? Yeah. What? With an actual lancer, he came through a screen. Oh my god. Like a goodness. plastic screen with one. That's hilarious. Yeah, it's pretty awesome. I don't know why. I remember when Gears 1 came out. Everyone was like, there has to be a sequel. And they were trying to keep it hidden forever that there wasn't going to be a sequel. And they're like, we haven't announced a sequel. We don't know if we're going to do one. And of course they were the whole time. And he came out and announced yeah. it. That's got to be in my top three most anticipated games of all time was Gears 2. When I was in high school. We were sophomores in high school when it came out. Mm. One of my most anticipated games of all time was Call of Duty Ghosts. Really? Oh, yes. yeah. And how'd that work out for you? It sucked. <laughs> yeah, I imagine so. Biggest disappointment of my life. I traded in Deus Ex, Black Ops 3, and Shadow of Mordor to pay for this. Wow. Yeah. I still had to pay almost 30 bucks, but yeah, it's okay. Could not have afforded it otherwise. It's a uh, desperate season we're in this fall. <laughs> so many games. <laughs> I see. So I had to make the sacrifice. Let's take the fabricator to another room so we can hold off more hordes. Yeah, I'm pretty strong. I'm moving this whole thing. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, they're helping oh, me, never mind. Cool. <laughs> I was going to say, man, JD is strong. <laughs> it's like Superman. Almost out. Oscar, that's her uncle's name, okay. You ever call him J-Dog? J-Dog! I probably will at some point when we get close. Oh, look at that. What the hell? <laughs> her screen's projected on it. I don't like her that. Her face is projected yeah, on it. Yeah, I don't like that. Oh, First Minister Jin, she's the daughter of Min, as he was a, uh, I don't know, a sergeant or something. They are 
in the first one. At first, I just thought you meant men in general. No, no that's her last name. What is this? You looking for a repeat of settlement two? A highly successful operation. It's now our most compliant settlement. Look, our village hasn't had power in weeks. We need this fabricator. I don't care about the goddamn fabricator. You're taking my people. What? Don't forget, I know what you were trained to do. Oh man. That was convenient. Uh, <laughs> what the hell was she talking about? No clue. But we need to get out of here. Watch out! <laughs> I don't want her to get killed again <laughs> by these machines. Uh, that's mysteriously convenient. Sorry I left you here. It's okay. Turns out it was safer inside. Hey, smart guy. We're really getting into that thing? We yeah, we're going for a joyride. Stay if you like. Takes off, you flip out the back, not hanging on. <laughs> what? There's a plane just swoops down and shoots cat. Kate. Oh my goodness. Well, there goes JD. Thankfully, yeah, there's a gun run. laying right nearby. Yeah. What the heck? Firing some jump. Oh boy. That's kind of cool. Some big guys. Okay. That's Tango. It'd be kind of a cool entrance to be dropped down in a dice. <laughs> yeah, it is quite a That's stylish absorbent. intro. These guys are tough. Yeah, you might want to shock distance. them. Ooh, ran at me. Run! Oh, got him. What's this gun called? The Overkill? Yeah, sounds awesome. This is a unique shotgun fires twice per trigger pull. Once when archery is pressed again. Is oh, okay. This is what I was mistaking a gun in Deus Ex for. Because I think I had watched a video of Gears gameplay and they were talking about this shotgun where if you shoot once and hold it and then let go, it shoots another one. Mm. And for some reason, I was playing Deus Ex at the same time and I thought it was in Deus Ex and I was so confused because I couldn't figure out how to do it all the time. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I'd say these guys have an advantage carrying this oh. thing around. Yeah, this thing's deadly. I like it. That's going to be fun in multiplayer too. Might be annoying for me, because I mean, if anyone comes out at me, at me with a shotgun, I'm pretty much doomed. I assume it's going to be like a power weapon or something. Usually, yeah. Whatever yeah, You always called. spawn with either a Lancer or a Hammer Burst, or I know there's a couple other rifles you can spawn with. The Nasher shotgun, the pistol, and a grenade, usually. And uh, this will definitely be a power weapon for sure. I, I still always thought, I know it would take away kind of from Gears' core gameplay, but I always thought it'd be cool to have a game mode where you don't spawn with a shotgun and you have to consider it a power weapon, kind of like in Halo, because I would encourage more cover-based shooting, I believe. That's the thing about Gears multiplayer is that it's very fun, and very occasionally people will utilize the cover and, and, and get in firefights, but more, more often than not, you're just running around like this, shooting each other. The closest they ever got was Gears 3. I really like Gears 3's multiplayer. Kate, help us! Kate, Dell, help me! Speaking of cover-based shooting, I'm thinking of how much of a disappointment the division was for me. Yeah, I didn't even get past level 14 in that game. I got to level 14 and asked myself, why am I playing this? And I stopped. See, I questioned that too, but I still you played it to get the platinum. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's amazing. I didn't even enjoy it either. I salute you for that. I don't know why. Man, blast these fools. BBs. The old hammer burst. What's the hammer burst do? It's the locust assault rifle. I can't Run! remember. Run! This guy's totally killing me. With his overkill. Run away! I think I've been down like 67 times already in this game. Probably closer to six or I seven. I keep saying like, yeah, I wish there was more cover-based shooting in the multiplayer and I'm not even using the cover in the campaign. What a hypocrite. Oh, you can pick it off. The try shot. Nice. Continuous fire not only overheats this weapon, but starts shutting down each of the three barrels one after after the Okay, cool. Mm -hmm. Okay, I have to cool so it So don't, uh... Yeah. This thing's brutal. Let's try it. Oh, no. Oh. Come out. Come out. Oh, boy. <laughs> Hello! Do you have to kneel down to use it? Yeah, it's that it's heavy. It's so heavy. Yeah. The more I'm fighting these robots, the more I'm kind of liking them, because they are much different than the Locust so far. Oh, he's going to explode. He's so exploding. Yep. So that makes it different in itself. They explode once they're about to die. I yeah. know there's some... There's it's kind of cool that they run towards you, too. Yeah. To there were some Locust enemies that were similar to that, but they were little bug creatures. Mm -hmm. and those big guys are intimidating. And I like all the guns that these robots have. Excuse me, the DBs. You know, Garrett, back when I was a gear... Back when I was part of the COG, 
They used to call me the Frag Daddy. Oh, really? Yes. The Frag Daddy. Yes. So I think we all used to be cog soldiers is the impression I'm getting from this conversation. Mm. We dropped out or something? That's kind of what they were talking about, I think. I gotta sneeze! <laughs> Sorry. <coughs> Sorry if I sneezed on you. It's okay. This thing's like a lawnmower vibrating know, so man. much. I think it's bothering me. <laughs> Maybe it's like semi-broken. Like, I swear when you shoot guns in games, it doesn't vibrate. It only vibrates when you get shot. No, it, it, it vibrates when you shoot guns. I promise. I don't think, I don't agree. I swear. <laughs> we'll put it to the test. Yeah, this is a serious act of war zone right now, my goodness. Yeah, I take it back. I like fighting the DBs because they have some really cool weapons. It's pretty fun. All new, which is exciting. Mm -hmm. I will say, though, this mission has been way too long for my taste. They got the end bar. They are so dead. Single file line, please. Yep, that'd be quite nice. Just oh. keep doing what you're doing. I think we got them all. What was that guy using? Is that the sniper? Yeah. There we go. Mission successful, Jacob. I thought that was a horse, but I was I was wrong. Now, this is Planet <laughs> Sarah. There's weird animals here. You're right about that. Oscar, come on. We gotta go. Sorry, hot shot. I drive. Fine. You drive. Look, I need you watching our backs. You're a better shot than I am. Huh. Really? No. I'm just trying to make really, you feel better. Really, <laughs> sir? Mm, this looks like a nice village. to settle and five myself. We, uh, we had a few snacks. What happened? The short version? The cog is under... We didn't kill a hundred robots. How long do we have? <laughs> How long oh, do no. we have? <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, it's Jen oh, again. Oh, gosh. That face. <laughs> First Minister. Reyna. I'm here for my people. Stand aside. You're out of your jurisdiction, First Minister. So, here's what happens next. Anyone who resists COG justice will be dealt with. Like Settlement 2? That's your choice. You're forgetting one thing. Oh? And what's that? <laughs> nice. This isn't Settlement 2. Okay. Good meeting. Oh, it's not over. Well, which settlement is it? I don't know. I think it said at the beginning when we were pulling in, I just wasn't paying attention. We'll see it in editing. So it seems the COG is mostly comprised of the DBs now. I think that's what the COG army is. It's like no longer humans. Yeah. That was a great opening, though. I kind of want to stop here. I think it's a good stopping point. But this is awesome so far. I like all the new weapons. I like fighting the DB. At first I was like, oh, robots, but they're interesting. They're much different than the Locust, which is cool. It's a I great could... start to the game, and I'm looking forward to meeting old man Marcus for the first time. For sure. Okay, yeah, they're freaking out about something. I don't know. I apologize, ladies and gentlemen, if we disrupted some of the cutscenes and uh, everyone's panicking, but overall I'm enjoying gear so far. I look forward to continuing in the story. It's going to be awesome. And uh, what do you think, Jake? Are you going to buy it anytime soon? I don't know. Um, I want to hear more of your thoughts about it once you've played more through it. Probably in the podcast coming out this next week. Absolutely. So, uh, it'll be your job to convince me to buy this. It does help that it comes with the four previous games. So. Indeed, yeah, I had no idea. If you guys didn't know, I'm so sick of it. I feel like I'm spoiling whatever's happening. I'm sorry, I'm talking over everything they're saying. <laughs> but, uh, yes, it does, this game does come with Gears 1, 2, and 3, and Judgment, all the download codes for the originals, which I had no idea that was included. I'm amazed that I haven't heard that until I bought the game, so... Yeah. Jumping into some multiplayer will be exciting as well, so I'm pumped. It's good to be back in Gears. Ladies and gentlemen, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a like. 
Subscribe for more. Join us every single week on the It's Obvious podcast. Join us on Xbox Live as well. We'll link our uh, gamer tags in the description from now on. we got PSN and Xbox Live. Hashtag not fanboys. Keep that in mind. It's important. As always, my name is Garrett Drake. This is Jacob Alka. We're It's Obvious Gaming, and we'll catch you again very soon. Thank you.